Hey everyone, this is Benjamin here from the African Geek and you are welcome to this fantastic video. In today's video, I'm going to be reviewing a very, very, very useful tool I discovered and this tool, what it does is it helps you to create videos online, okay? And it does most of the work for you because once I was going through, I was just so, so, so surprised that there was something like this and I didn't even know from the beginning. So relax, okay? Because once I come back after my intro, I'll be going to walk you through every single thing you need to know about this tool. So stay tuned and let the intro begin. Alright, so I have my browser opened and you can see the first thing you need to do before you can access this tool is to have your browser open. Okay, and um, we'll just search for app.animator. Okay, that's the name or that's the URL to this um, tool I was referring to. But you, the first thing I'll need you to know is that before you can start using this, you actually have to sign up, okay? And um, it's a pro tool, even though they have the free version. But I have a special link in the description that can just help you to, you know, to get a discount off and all of that, so that you can also enjoy this tool so much because this is very, very, very cool. Like, trust me, it's a very cool app. So once you sign up, okay, this is what you see. This is your dashboard and it's similar to canva that's what i realized the dashboard is similar to canva so if you're a canva user then you know you'd understand why i'm saying it's similar to canva and you can see there are so so many videos you can create with this and before you even get started let's say you already have the dimension you know the type of video you want to create we have all the dimensions you know over here so we have horizontal which is 16 by 9 which is equal to 1920 by 1080 and can be used for you know youtube videos can be used for presentations and stuff like that you know and we also have the vertical for let's say if you want to put on your instagram story okay or your reel you can also use that square for a regular instagram feed and stuff like that so you can see so many dimensions you can also add your custom dimension and yeah you know it's very easy i think with this it's very easy with simplicity it makes it easy and um let's say you know you wanted to create a video but do you know the type of video you want to create they already have um, some suggested videos over here so video ads you can see very 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 nice okay so in terms of ad if you want to run ads maybe a video ad and um, you you know you just don't know how to create one this app would help you should I even say an app this tool would help you create such things okay so social media okay you can create a very simple um video like we have over here reasons to you know to do yoga and stuff like that the kind of pop which is a music kind of thing invites instagram videos you know intros and outros so if you have a youtube video okay and you're struggling to even make intros and outros look this tool will sort you out okay and that's one thing i also um realized from here you can see so 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 many um, interesting things so depending on the video you want to create you can even search okay with you know with a search bar we have provided here and after you search for presentation it gives you so many options okay so so many options so now it's up to you to choose which one you want to um use so let's say now we have all of these options i'm just going to choose one of these videos and i would walk you through how to edit the video and how to customize and do all of the magic things you want to do okay so I click on this one for example and it should load a little bit to get things ready for me to go in and be doing the things I want to do okay yeah so depending on your internet also <laughs> the loading will also um, delay or be faster that's what I also realized okay so you can see this is the edit um, area for animaker where you can just change things and do all the things you want to do on the left side okay we have so many things so we have pre-built templates so so many templates also over here okay and um, once i click you can see so many templates i can just choose to place this one okay then we have the next one which is the characters so animaker has a lot of characters and you can see they keep adding characters day in day out okay so you can be assured that your characters are going to be unique because so many characters you know are being added day in day out you understand and the third um option you have over here is properties so with properties you can um choose let's say a shape you know we have you know certain um elements we, we call it element when in canva we call it element so 
you can choose some of these things in your videos you know let's say you want to use um, you want writing to appear on the screen you have a computer screen over here you have some emojis you know so many interesting things over here so let's say you wanted to have someone sitting down and typing you can go in for this table because it has a computer on the table you get it very easy then we have the text so with this option it helps you to add text and to edit text and it's just similar to canva you know how we have it over here just similar to canva and um, if you're in canva you shouldn't be confused okay the next one is the background so depending on what you're making okay you need certain backgrounds to be able to um, make your video complete okay so depending on what you're doing you would require a certain background so we have the office background we have gradients photo background video background business background home nature police that's the police public places streets you can see so many things even with sports city look you, you just need to go through them and let's say travel i can click on the plus icon to get more of travel stuff you get it so this is a very 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 interesting um tool you should be using by now i'm sure you are getting ready to just sign up okay don't forget there's a link below that would help you to um, sign up quickly then images we also have some cool images over here so depending on what you're creating like i keep saying you just need to choose the images that help to um, communicate whatever you want to communicate okay then we have videos we have music and we have what is even the special effect so you can also add special effects and your upload you can also upload stuff in here and use them we have gifs you know in the images we have the gifs and you can also upload images okay then over here on the right side we have the scene so the scene is let's say um scene one so this alone is scene one and let me just collapse this so that i can show you and explain what i mean so if i click on the play you see with the text coming in and the guy over here just this alone is scene one an entire video is is made up of different scenes when it comes to animaker okay i'm just explaining it in terms of animaker an entire video has to do with several scenes so depending on how long you want your video to be and stuff like that it would also um that will depend on the number of scenes you need okay so if i play the entire video you can see okay it, it needs to load first okay so this is scene one when it changes it means this is scene two okay so now we are in scene two then we are also in scene three right now if it changes again scene four and it moves on and on and on and on like that okay so that's um, pretty much how you can just you know do things over here let me just close this up okay so now how do we edit stuff here that's a very important thing we all need to know i hope you agree okay so we have the text over here we have the guy over here let's start with the text to edit the text you only need to click on the text and you can just change so maybe i can say african african am i spelling correctly african geek um office tour okay and i can just you know increase it position you can do so many things you know you, you have the freedom to do anything at all you want I can position it here I can move this up you know just move it up and move also you know it up and I can even change the colors you can see I can once you click it gives you the option to change colors I can also click this and change the color okay so I'm just going to be showing you stuff I'm not making any serious video right now I'm just walking you through how you can create your own video okay so if you also click on this guy you see we have several options over here so if i click on this you know it's the action you want the guy to perform and you can make him cry you can make him just stand there looking at us you can make him you know do his hand this way you know let's say it was an explainer video and some text were appearing you can make his hand be there as if he's talking and stuff like that and also you can even add with audios i would explain that later don't go anywhere don't go anywhere i would explain that to you you can also add multiple actions okay so you can add just a single action or even multiple actions so i mentioned earlier that you can add actions okay so with these actions over here you can choose uh, you know any of these actions for your character to be you know to be doing them okay and what you can also do is you can add multiple actions so let's say this is the first action i want him to do then i can click a plus okay then come here to click another plus 
and I can choose any other action. So it means that he starts off by, you know, doing that thing he was doing, moving his hand to a second one. And I can click on the tick and apply. Okay. So if I play the scene, this is how it's going to look like. Okay. So you can see a change to a different action. Okay. So you can determine the duration of the action. So the first action takes place at 0 0.5 seconds and you can see it's too close. So I can move this to maybe two seconds or, you know, just pull it, you know, to a far place so that um, we can actually see all of the actions he, he does. Then I click on the tick and apply it. Okay, or if you want to add another action, you can just click on the plus. But you can see the reason why it's saying this is, um, this is for this scene, it's only up to um, 2.8 seconds. That's why it cannot go in more. Okay, so I just click on apply for now. Nice one. So another thing you can do is to add the audio, like I mentioned earlier. So you can record your voice. And because I'm currently recording, you know, with my mic, it wouldn't allow me. But you can record your voice. You can use a text to speech. Which means that you add the text and it will just read it okay so your computer will be doing the reading and um, it will be like your character is actually talking and you can also record your voice and upload into animaker so that um, it just syncs everything for you so the next thing you can do is to change colors okay so you click on change color and you can see the skin the eye the hair the face everything about the character you can change colors okay so Let's see what the um, top is wearing. I can just click change color to yellow. And with the second one, I believe is the tie, change it to blue. Very easy. With the bottom, uh, maybe I want a fancy um, character. So, you know, his fashion, you know, he has a strong sense of fashion. So, yeah, this is what I want him to get right now. Then I can click on this to swap. Maybe I want to swap him to maybe another character over here. You can just do that okay but i think i just like him right now okay so another thing you can also do is to create um what we call a smart move okay so to do this what it does is you click on him and um we use our timeline okay so maybe at zero seconds or at the beginning i want him to be here okay then at maybe two seconds here yeah, two seconds i want him to be here so if I click on apply and the video starts, this is how it's going to look like. So let me just play. So you can see there was some sort of movement. Okay. And that's what you can also do. So in this, you can use it for cars and stuff like that. The same um, thing I did. Okay. Yeah. The next thing I would want to explain to you is, you know, with these shapes, you can pretty much just change colors and everything. So let's now check the scene two. So you can see with scene two, we have the text at the top you know with our shapes and stuff like that to change them you can just you know like i was saying with the text you just click so i can say we are a happy family okay how am i spelling family yeah so family like that and um so you can see we have this guy waving we have this one folded arms and the lady standing there um you know gorgeous so i can click him and just change his action so to change it you make sure you have the action selected and i can just make him jump okay but he looks smaller so i'll increase his size a little bit okay then what we can do is you can right click on him and move him to the back so that his face wouldn't be hitting the boss's face and i'll make him bigger more so you can see what we are doing there are so many things so i can click on this lady and i can also you know let her to say hello so i can also select this and now i change um her action or i can make her sit down okay but it means that we need to go into the properties and um, it looks like she's sick okay so we can just give her a chair or something to sit on because we need to be polite she can't be sitting in the air okay so um what can we even use here okay let's say this bench for example okay so we can just make it bigger no rather make it smaller Okay, because she needs to sit down so I'll make it smaller more and I right click and send it to the back okay so this is what we have at the moment okay but I'll just undo just to you know keep it simple all right so this is what we have at the moment okay so let's say um, we're done editing because with what I've explained to you so far that's the same things you're going to be doing changing text 
background so if i want to change the background i just click on my background okay and you can change the filters and all of that but you can also come here move to background and just change the background to a different background okay if you, if you want the gradient you can change it okay but uh this is okay because we want the um, the office look and feel all right yeah so this is you know some of the things you can do over here and if you add your audio you know the audio also be at the bottom or you can even add some music i understand and i believe that it's it will actually help you to create something very very interesting okay so we have up to 12 scenes and let's say this is what this is where the changes i wanted to make how do i save it and how do i share so before i save i want to rename my video that um african oh okay so african geek tour okay and yes so i come to publish i can download my video download it as a gif and i can publish it straight to youtube twitter and um also to linkedin instagram we have all of these things here to whatsapp you can share it to all of that by just click on download video and um, we have several options okay so i'll just choose um the hd 720p and download so it should just load and yes it's downloading it's putting everything together and doing what it needs to do so with this when you get to this stage you only need to relax if you have some coffee or a drink by you you can just take your time by sipping okay and we'll just have to wait for it to be done fantastic so now that it's done exporting it means we can actually now download it onto our computer so once you click it would load and you can see i have it downloaded right now so i can now share it wherever i want to share it to and yes so with a tool like this after going through i just thought as the best so far i haven't seen anything like this you know that's able to make me create um very interesting videos within minutes okay so if you know you have this opportunity i believe that you should also take advantage of this and yes use it and start impressing your boss your co-workers and everyone in your in your business and out of a scale of one to ten i'll give this you know an eight okay i'll give this to an eight because it's a very very helpful tool my name is benjamin and i hope you enjoyed this video i would see you in my next video Thank you.